Today a reader, tomorrow a leader. SSET English Town. Hi again, everybody. Okay, today we will continue in Grammar Wonder One again. Then we will continue with lesson 19 on page 86. So, last time we did prepositions of place, and today we will do prepositions of time. So, if you remember, a preposition can tell where or when. So last time, we did where, and this time, we will do when. So first, we have at. At can tell us when for a specific time. So, a time is like 7 o'clock or 8.30. You can write it with numbers or you can write it with letters. Then we have on. We can use on with many things. We can use on with uh, days of the week. with dates, with holidays, and with special days. So, day of the week just means Monday to Sunday. On Monday, I did my homework. On Tuesday, I watched Rose Teacher's video. Okay? Days of the week. Then we have dates. A date means when you say the month and the number. So, today is March 30th. Or we can say on April 5th. We give the month and the number. That is date. Holidays, you know holiday. Holiday is like Christmas. And then we have special days, like birthday. On my birthday, I played with my friends. Then our last preposition, our last word is in. In we use with months, we use with seasons, and years, and parts of the day. So, month is January to December. Season is like spring. We start school in spring. Year 
is like 2020. This year is 2020. In 2019, we met Rose Teacher. And then parts of the day is like morning. In the morning, in the afternoon, but with night, we always say at. So at for time and night. In the morning, I woke up. In the afternoon, I played. At night, I went to bed. Okay. So try page 86 and 87, and then let's correct them together. It's okay if you can't do them yet. So let's see, page 86. Part A. This is Mark's daily schedule. So let's fill it in. He gets up when? He gets up at 7.30. Number two, he goes to school at 8 o'clock. Number three, he has lunch at 12 o'clock. Number four, he goes home at 3 o'clock. And then finally, he goes to bed at 10.30. Okay, now let's do part B on page 87. Oh, so for part B, you write on in every blank. One to nine, every blank. So it says on Saturday, on April 5th, on New Year's Day, on Children's Day, on Friday, on my birthday, on October 1st, on Halloween, on Monday. Easy. And part C is same, but in. So we have in summer, in April, in the morning, in 1988, in spring, in September, in the evening, in fall, and in the afternoon. Easy. Okay. Now do page 88 and 89. Do them all and then we will go over the answers.
you are finished both pages, then you can watch. If you did not finish, please stop the video and do these pages first, okay? Stop, do the work, and then watch. Okay, so let's do part A. Number one, Sunday. Sunday is day of the week. We say on. Number two, nine o'clock. Nine o'clock is time. We say at. Number three, winter. Season in. In winter. Number four, afternoon. Time of the day. We say in. In the afternoon. Number five, May 5th is date. We say on. Number six, dinner time. Dinner time is time of day. Dinner time is at, at dinner time. Twenty fourteen. That is a year. So we say in. Number eight, Jane's birthday. That's a special day. We say on. Number nine, New Year's Day. New Year's Day is a holiday, so we say on. And number ten, December. December is a month, so in. In December. Okay, number one, part B. Mom gets up early in the morning. Number two. You can see many flowers in spring. Number three, they played badminton at lunchtime. If it ends in time, like dinner time, lunch time, we say at. So we had lots of fun on Children's Day. Number five, Pat and I met at three o'clock yesterday. And six, my family will go to a movie on Friday. And part C, change and the underlying word and rewrite. I go to bed on 10.30. 10.30 is time, so we say I go to bed at 10.30. Number two, you must not go out in night. Remember, night is special. We always say at night. You must not go out at night. Number three, we can ski at winter. Winter is season. We can ski in winter. Number four, spring begins on March. March is a month, so we say in. Number five, he will visit London in May 10th. May 10th is a date, so we say on. And number six, they go jogging at the evening. Well, the evening is a time of the day. We say in. Okay. Remember, capital 
capital letters and periods. Always, 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 always. Okay? Um, now, writing practice on page 89. So I will read one time and then we will go through and fix. There are four mistakes. Dave goes to school in 8 o'clock. He plays basketball with his friends on the afternoon. He learns Taekwondo at Wednesdays. He will go camping on summer. So the mistakes we want are within, on, at. So we want to pay attention to those words, right? So let's start. Dave goes to school in 8 o'clock. Hmm. 8 o'clock is a time. We say at. You can always check this page, these pages in your book. So we start. Dave goes to school at 8 o'clock. He, he plays basketball with his friends in the afternoon. He learns Taekwondo at Wednesdays. He learns on Wednesdays. And finally, he will go camping in summer. Okay, on your own, on the bottom of page 89, this little purple box. Mike made a plan for next year. So, number one, he will get up early. Get up early when? In the morning. Number two, he will jump rope. When? At night. Number three, he will go to the library. When? On Saturdays. When we put S on day of the week, like Saturdays, that means every week Saturday. On Mondays, Wednesdays, and Fridays, you have English Academy. Every Monday and Wednesday and Friday, you come to English Academy. And number four, he will travel to Japan when in winter. Okay, please check all of your answers. Make sure that you got them correct. Now, before you watch the next part of the video, please finish your workbook, page 38 and 39 for unit 19. So please do this now 
and then you can watch the rest of the video where we go through the answers. Okay, I will see you guys then. Hi again, everybody. Okay, let's continue with Grammar 101 in the workbook. And I hope you finished Unit 19, page 38 and 39. If you didn't finish, please stop the video and do these two pages right now, okay? So, let's start. Okay, I go to school at 8, part A, number 1, at. Number 2, my birthday is in January. Number three, they go jogging in the evening. Number four, I will go to Paris on May 10th. Number five, we can see many flowers in spring. Number six, I don't go to school on Sundays. Part B, the children play baseball lunchtime. One. Number two. Susan's family will have a party on New Year's Day. Number three. And three. I eat lunch at noon. I go home at 2.30. Answer three. And part C, number one. Dad gets up early in the morning. He has breakfast at 7 o'clock. He comes back home late at night. Number two, Ryan goes to school at 8 o'clock. He eats lunch at noon. He comes back home in the afternoon. He plays baseball with his father on Saturdays. Okay, check your answers for page 38. Now, page 39. Circle the correct words. So there are four parts. So I did one, two, three, four. Dear Marion, hi. My birthday is on October 6th. I will have a party. The party will start at 12.30. In the afternoon. Please come to my birthday party. Let's meet at noon in front of our school. Okay, part E, translation. Number one, my birthday is in December. Number two, we go jogging in the evening. Number three, he goes to bed at 11 o'clock. And number five, they had fun on New Year's Day. Part 
Part F, dictation. Number one, let's meet at dinner time. Number two, my sister jumps rope in the morning. Number three, I will go to a movie on Friday. The movie starts at seven. Number four, Ron made a plan for this year. He will go jogging at night. He will go to the library on Sundays. He will travel to Japan in summer. Okay, check your answers. The translation, remember capital letter on first and for months and New Year's Day, period, at the end. And in dictation, Sunday, capital, and S at the end, Sundays. Okay? So check all of your answers for your workbook. Okay. Thank you for watching this video, and I will see you next time for Unit 20. Today a reader, tomorrow a leader. SSET English Town.